Hey, what's up guys? As you can hear, I'm back in the basement. <laughs> anyway, today I have a quick overview, which is um, part of a, some little shopping and editing online lately. And uh, I was lucky enough to find some good product. But anyway, um, due to the, um, the fact that my, for example, my wife likes to shoot a lot of at the range from a bench, but she doesn't want to head and buy put the rear rifle and then consequently increase the weight of the gun. Um, we were looking at other solution to in order to let her, you know, have some kind of support when she's shooting a rifle at the target local ranges. There are also local ranges that you, allows you only to shoot sitting from a bench, which is, well, don't let me even make it start that. But anyway, we're looking for a solution. Among uh, some of them, mostly for um, portability and easy to use, uh, I found this from uh, Voodoo Tactical, which is the rifle bean bag. And I give you a briefly description of this product. It's been designed by a sniper, designed to be uh, placed under the buttstock, of course, and under the barrel of the gun. And uh, can be also used uh, over, over, over the roof or a fence ledgers, allow you uh, to have a firm support um, between the barrel and the barrier. Of course, like a support, like I said. Uh, it has three attachments, uh, like here, down, here, and another one on the back um, that allows you to um, pretty much um, if you want to attach to something or carry on your backpack or um, you know do some other things I'm gonna mostly use it for the front of the rifle um, empty looks like give an idea briefly that's something bigger than a case of the camera pretty much very compact also it's very uh, accessible I believe mine was like 15 bucks shipped from Amazon and um, you can fill it with sand and uh, or um, some plastic pellets or some common rice you're gonna need a pretty much half of a of a three pound bag so we say you need probably one pound one pound and a half i spilled some so <laughs> i kind of lost track of how much i used for uh you might not use a funnel actually because the way to access to the um, um pow so sleeve or whatever you want to call it, the hole where you can insert the sole is right over here, which has some velcro. And anyway, you open this and you, with a funnel, might be easier, you can fill it and a little bit, you know, shake it, level it, fill it again. And like I said, it's actually pretty firm. I'm kind of surprised. I might need, a little bit, might need to add a little bit of um, rice, just a little tiny bit. Other than that, I mean, it's easy to carry, doesn't weigh a lot. Um, if you were traveling, you can empty. If you go shooting somewhere, you know, there's sand, you can fill it with sand or dirt, whatever. <laughs> And um, what else? It can attach to a backpack. It can fit clearly. Can fit in a in a, in a range bag compared to other product. That's it, guys. That was a quick uh, impression of the Voodoo Tactica rifle bin bag. Um, like I said, it is what it is for what it cost. I like it so far. Let's see how it perform shooting. Again, nothing was going to be too um, aggressive on it. It's going to be probably a bench shooting, but I. Have so far, it seems, seems like it's been um, according to what they um, offer you. Seems like a decent product. All right, thank you very much. If you have anything similar or better, or you think it might be better than this, let me know. If you have a, a same one, give me your feedback. I'm that's more than welcome. Thank you for watching. And see you next time. Bye.